Hi Cubies, here's Alexandra again. Well, I know I have told you that I will not buy the new uh, Games Workshop color line, but to be honest, uh, I get messages at least two to five per day regarding the new colors. And so um, I have bitten into the sour apple and I have uh, bought me a set of <coughs> the new colors. Uh, I have not bought every single one, but I just want to show you now my uh, color range I have for the start now. So I started with the base colors in the new color line. Those are those 10 I have bought. <coughs> so uh, first of all, black and white, they are essential for everything. Then I have uh, the main colors, blue, yellow and red. So for that purpose I have here Muckridge Blue, Avalet Sunset and Corn Red. They are basically uh, the exchange versions of um, Mordian Blue, Yant Dark Sun and Macred Red. So very important colors. And then I have also uh, here a Skin Tone. This is Red Skin Flash. Then Caliban Green. Then I have two brown tones here Mornfang Brown and Rhinox Hide. Uh, well, actually, three brown tones. This here is the XV88. This is uh, like the old snake bite leather. This is um, simple bestial brown, and this here is more like a um, scorch brown. So <coughs> those I have bought. These are the base colors, like I said. So let's put them aside. And now I have uh, the washes. I have bought me four of them. So Moon Oil. This is the black one. Then Reichland Shade. I guess this is uh, the new Devil and Mud. Then I'm uh, here Agrax Earth Shade. I need Reichland Flash Shade. This is the old Ogren Flash Wash. And this here is the new Devil and Mud Agrax Earth Shade. And uh, Seraphim Sepia. Those are the for washes, very essential colors. And then for the layer paints, I also started uh, a collection with uh, three, three base colors, a blue, yellow, and a red. So I've here bought me the Flesh Kids Yellow, then Evil Sun's Scarlet, and Techless Blue. So then we came to the metal colors. I have bought me three of those. Uh, no, actually four. There I have <coughs> those here. I have bought me a bronze tone. This is a Hushood Copper. A Runfang Steel. This is uh, the new Mithril Silver version. Uh, the new bolt gun metal is now called Iron Breaker. And a gold. This here is Auric Armor Gold. So, those four are the metal versions. And then I have some additional colors uh, to complete the set. This is a second flesh tone, Bestie Gore Flesh. Then another brown tone. This is Scrag Brown. Then we have a nice green tone. This is Mood Green. This is uh, like Scorpion Green. And with a, yeah, here with a Caliban Green and mixed in blues and yellows, I can mix uh, almost every green tone I want to have. So then we have here the Bleached Bone equivalent. This is Screaming Skull. And then we have Xeroy's Purple. Tone. and a grey tone. This is Eshin Grey. So that wraps up the 
GW colors I have now for my painting tutorials. And I get also questions a lot. Why do you switch to uh, Vallejo and now to uh, the new GW line and don't stick to the old paints? Well, the reason for that is very simple. I want to provide you guys with painting tutorials with uh, colors that I use that you can still buy. And with the old colors, that's impossible. So all my old colors are now on my painting station here next to my computer. And uh, I simply use them for my own paintings, but for tutorial purposes, I use now this line and in combination with my Vallejo line. And those I will show you now. Here, this is a mixture out of uh, <coughs> the Vallejo colors with the new pots I have bought, but uh, you will uh, see what is in there. So we have here uh, two very dark tones. This is uh, the black and smoke. This is from Vallejo model color. This is from Vallejo game color. Here's the number and uh, they can tell what exact bottle you have to buy. So those two. Then uh, we have several green tones here. So we have here a deep green. Then lime green. Next is olive green. Sick green. So, and in combination with the Games Workshop colors, I have a very nice palette. So, then I have uh, several other skin tones. <coughs> so, those are that here. First, a rosy flash. This is uh, like the old GW um, equivalent to an elf flash. Then uh, we have Solomon Rose. It's almost the same color. A slightly different tone. It's, it's like a mixture between the old dwarf flash and elf flash. So a little bit darker than this one, but not very much. And then we have here an equivalent to the old bronzed flash. This is dark flash from Vallejo model color. So, of course, I have also a yellow tone. This is more like a goldenish yellow. And this is uh, like a um, lemon yellow. Or Zitronengelb, <laughs> we say here in German. So, then we have uh, red tones. Of course, here a uh, dark red flat red and an orange tone. Dark red, flat red and hot orange. So then I have two blue tones here. Magic blue and Prussian blue. So, like I said, you can always pause the video and uh, Write down the color names if you want. So then we have uh, some beiges here. <coughs> so this is sand yellow. Stone gray. Ivory. This is like a 50-50 mix out of bleached bone and white. Very bright. And then we have here pale sand. This is like a normal bleach bone. So then we have additional brown tones, flat earth, and burnt cat ready. This is a reddish brown tone, also very nice. So then we have here violet. And a bright bronze. I also have um, the Vallejo uh, game color uh, silver and gold, but I don't have them right here simply because they are absolutely shit. I would not recommend them. Those are the worst metal paints you can ever find. So stick with the Games Workshop uh, metal paints or uh, with a Vallejo uh, model air, but uh, 
with a game color metal no this is uh, absolutely no go terrible stuff so <clears throat> this is now uh, the complete set of my colors that I use from now on for my uh, painting tutorials I will like I said use a mix out of uh, Vallejo and Games Workshop colors of course I will expand here and there uh, and buy me uh, here and there one or two new colors but uh, Overall, this is my starting base for the new painting tutorials. I hope this uh, helps you a little bit uh, to choose your own new colors if you uh, want to buy some. And, well, we see us in the next video. You're Alexandra.